Okay, so uh, first up, Deadpool and Wolverine has clawed its way to the top of the box office, smashing records left and right. In its opening weekend, the movie brought in a staggering $200 million. Yeah, you heard that right. Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman are back, and they're breaking more than just a fourth wall. The film, blending the snark of Deadpool with Wolverine's gruff demeanor, has struck box office gold. Proving once again that audiences still do love a good superhero team up. The movie's success is a testament to the chemistry between Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman, who have turned their on screen camaraderie into box office gold. So let's get into the nitty gritty, right? Deadpool and Wolverine didn't just stroll in the theaters, it came in like a wrecking ball, smashing records left and right. First up, it nabbed the highest R-rated opening of all time, raking in a full $444.1 million worldwide, and that's $211 million domestic. That's right. Deadpool dethrones Deadpool? Because the first movie actually held the previous record, but this sequel just said, you know, hold my beer. And it didn't stop there. The movie also had the biggest global opening since Avatar The Way of Water. It's definitely making waves, right? <laughs> Ryan Reynolds and Hugh Jackman are officially box office royalty at this point. Ryan even had his biggest domestic opening ever, beating out his own record with the first dip. And Hugh, he sliced through his previous best, outdoing X-Men The Last Day. These guys are sharp at these numbers. The film helped the MCU continue to dominate as the highest grossing film franchise of all time, pulling in a whopping $30 billion across 34 titles. And guess what? Deadpool and Wolverine also marks Marvel's 34th consecutive MCU release to debut at number one domestically. That's, that's really impressive. I can't even front. I didn't even realize that they released all 34 of their movies to debut at number one. Let's talk about the real heroes, the fans. Social media is lit with reactions. Some folks are loving the blend of humor and action, saying it's the best thing since Wi-Fi. Others are already speculating about what's next. Could this mean like a bigger role for these characters in Avengers Secret Wars? We'll find out given time. One thing's for sure. Marvel knows how to keep us hooked. It's not just these numbers that are impressive. Fans and critics are alike are raving about the film's unique blend of humor, action, and art. I know when I saw the movie, I came out glowing, singing praises for Marvel, ready to hop back in. As someone who was out, I was back in. It's a mix that only Deadpool and Wolverine could deliver with their banter, adding this fresh twist to the superhero genre that captivated my heart. Their journey through alternate realities also allowed for some really cool unexpected cameos that went so far with keeping me on my toes. This is not just a regular superhero movie. It's a Marvel fan cultural event. If you've somehow managed to not be spoiled on social media and you're a little bit curious, maybe you were turned off from Marvel in the past and you're wondering if now's a good time, go see this movie. If you've already seen the spoilers, I'm going to be pretty disappointed if you see this. So what does this mean for the future of Marvel projects? If Deadpool and Wolverine is any indication, we can probably expect more bold and unconventional pairings like this. The success of this film could pave the way for other characters to cross paths in unexpected ways. Fans are already wondering, when are we going to see Deadpool and Spider-Man? Look, the multiverse concept has opened up a Pandora's box of storytelling possibilities, and we can't wait to see what's next. For now, though, let's just enjoy the ride and watch this dynamic duo continue to dominate the box office. Ooh, and there's more. There is more. You guys ready for this one? <laughs> 